Hi guys, please ignore this. I just got out of the shower. I have to talk very quietly. I'm like hiding in one of the rooms upstairs, but I have a surprise this week for Jess. He has no idea. So his birthday is actually in a little over a week. I plan for us to take a trip for about three days. Sorry, Mason's being nosy. So I planned this trip for me and Jess to go on for like two, three days um, in Ocean City. So um, he has no idea. I wanted to do like a little something special for him and more like a, um, just like a getaway. There's been a lot going on, you know, the competition and just like pool stuff, house stuff. Just like a lot of things have been going on behind the scenes. And also I have another big surprise for tomorrow that I wanna tell him. Um, I got two reservations for dinner, so I'm gonna let him pick which one he wants to go to. The one I'm really excited about, but honestly, I'm not sure if he wants to go out to dinner. Um, the one I know will be very busy with a lot of people. So like I completely get, you know, with COVID and stuff, like I, I really don't know. So I'm also really excited about this trip because Jess and I have always talked about how cute and how fun it would be to bring the dogs to the beach. I don't know how they would act on the beach but I think it would be like really special and a really cute moment but I want to make this trip like really memorable and really cute and just like relaxing and fun. And it's currently downstairs so let's go fill him in. I'm not going to tell him everything. I'm just going to tell him we're going on a trip and that's it because I want to wait until you know right before we leave of like what's going on. I'm really excited. Let's go tell him. Hi, bye. Yo. What are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, it's playing with Jenny. Why? You got any plans this week? Uh, we're gonna do a blackjack stream. When? Probably Thursday. Well, that's not gonna work. Oh, is that what it is? <laughs> what well, is what? <laughs> that's why. Why what? Because I was said I was, you know, trying to get Uncle Larry Tom for Blackjack stream. It was like Thursday, Friday, Saturday. I wouldn't do it early so we go up to PA. But <laughs> you were like, yeah, probably Friday. I was like, okay. Mm -hmm. I was like, I was thinking Thursday. You're like, nah. Oh. And now you're filming me suddenly. So you're up to some I'm up to some. I can see how it feels now. Yeah. Usually I'm the one that does the surprising. So. Uh huh. Yeah. How's it feel? <laughs> he actually got me. <laughs> I'm usually not uh, at a loss for words, but you actually got me a little little shook up right now. Oh, so. good. So yeah, you're you're all mine until Friday morning. Morning. Yeah. What does that mean though? <laughs> so I just gotta block out Thursday. Is that what you're saying? Tuesday evening through Friday morning. Yeah. I so I wanted to tell you now, which it is Monday. So you don't so make the day plans. Before, the day before. So you don't make plans because I know pool people and things are happening. So that's going to have to yeah. change. What the f <laughs> is going on? We're going on a little trip. Just Where a little, little trip. Where are we going? Just is a that little, not little. part of it? Part of what? I'm not supposed to know. Is that? You weren't supposed to know. I've been planning it for two months, but. Well, I booked it two months ago. Okay, so... But, so, we are celebrating your birthday early, if, if that's an <laughs> indication. Uh, okay. <laughs> so, we will be up in PA for Yes, for your birthday. But this, that's how I this planned is the it. gift is happening. Well, there's a couple of, more, but this, oh, is, this is the main one. Okay. Tomorrow. That's all I know. It's just pack a small bag You gotta pack bag a small bag. Kind. I guess it's Airbnb, because... Uh, it is an Airbnb. Okay, that's what I figured, yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh! <laughs> oh! It'll be fun, bye! Yeah? <laughs> I mean, it's definitely a surprise. Thanks. I have some, some thoughts on maybe what it could Ooh, be. Oh, tell but, me. Oh, really? Yeah, well, I'm, I mean, I'm not just, gonna confirm or deny. We'll wait till tomorrow. I mean, you said but... it's a small trip, and I know you usually like going to Ocean City or the beach vibes around this time where it is a little bit less crowded that's yeah. the only thing that would be a small trip that would make sense because there's no nowhere else that i feel like you would want to go that I, also i would probably enjoy too oh. yeah i have no idea i think it's some jersey shore some jersey shore related <laughs> stuff okay that's that's technically there's two surprises this is the one but oh okay so pack a bag Woo! do i need a bathing suit or no you pack your clothes. If I think that you need additional things, I'll pack it for you. Okay. All right. This is <laughs> up. <laughs> for 
babe's 30th birthday. Is my mom coming? No. Oh, okay. I wasn't sure. It was me, you, and my mom or something. <laughs> what? Do you want your mom? Uh, I was referencing, we, we're watching White Lotus, guys. It's a really good show. Oh, and yeah, you should watch it. Okay. You excited? Me. Strong as your knee. They don't know that. Yeah, I tore, so I tore both MCLs like three years ago. Four, almost four now. I like just retore the right one. Uh, like a week and a half ago. I thought it was getting better and then no, I can barely walk, so. Uh, perfect timing for this trip. <laughs> dude, there has been no perfect time for this. It's f***ing miserable for the last few <laughs> years, but I'm sorry to inconvenience uh, this surprise trip. I don't even know where we're going, dude. Well, I think you know where we're going. I've I, I've had my two guesses, but. I, what I, are I your could, guesses? I could flip a coin. It was ACOC, I could flip a coin. We're going to Ocean City. Are we? Yeah. Thank God, okay, good. Although I don't know how much you can do in Ocean City. That's where we're going. Cause well, we have you can't Air walk. We have an Airbnb. Yeah. So okay, we have an Airbnb. Yeah, that's what I figured. So then I can rest. What are you talking it about? It is about three blocks from the beach, but it's okay. in town, so it's next to all the restaurants. Gotcha. All right, that's cool. To be honest, I've barely been to Ocean City except for like late night boardwalk thing or like. Okay, oh cool. my, dude! Two bald eagles. <gasps> oh my god! What the hell does that mean? <laughs> What the f What does that mean? They were you. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> Where did they go? Did you like look at it off camera too? Yes. I, Dude, yeah, what the the holy crap. That's crazy. Good so, surprise, yeah, Ashley. Okay, yes. You got <laughs> that, that, that was the surprise. That was good. You got me there. Okay, wait, wait. There's more. There's more. Okay, so Why, we're going to Ocean City. It all now? Yeah, we're going to Ocean City, oh. but don't expect the nicest place. I know. I because the dogs are coming. Huh? Oh Lord. So we've always talked about bringing the dogs to the beach. Oh, uh, oh, I see. And we've never done that. We've always talked about how cute that would be. We like for them experiencing it, kind of chill and relaxing. So we're bringing. Don't. Oh my God, are you upset? Huh? I'm just. <laughs> You're just my like. Face. Uh, Look at my knee. Right. I'm, I have I to know, keep my I leg know, like know. this. So the dogs are coming with us. I got a dog-friendly Airbnb. I beach. know. I wish my knee wasn't blown apart. I'd, I'd have a much better bigger reaction the eagles were a nice touch though well i didn't plan that but what let's say i just did <laughs> yeah it seems like you did making ashley carry all her into the place here i haven't walked in yet so oh god oh you guys don't even know oh oh nice we got the wall units dude these are always so cold cool cold Bathroom. Oh yeah, icy. Nice. What's in here? Alright, this is probably where my room is. So that one's Ashley's, I guess. Can you imagine she makes me get out the top bunk of my knee? Nice, bye. I think it's cozy. Yeah, you get the wall units. That's the best part. Really? No, I'm serious. It's always colder. I feel like they're slept on. As long as the couch is comfortable. Oh yeah. Guys, some of you are probably like, bro, what the What's wrong with your knee like so bad? This goes back to December 2018. I was doing like an insanity while running, while lifting, while like super low carb. And the wear and tear, I think was too much and I wasn't taking breaks because I was just like, same like YouTube mindset of like grind, 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 grind. And I was like, I had the six pack going as Isaac and still, I blew my knees clean out. And then I never really talked about it on camera. It kind of was like a spleen, it was literally like a spleen thing where I just pushed myself too hard and then I had all these health issues. Midway through 2019, when I took the long break, a huge reason for that was my knee. I, it was, it literally hurt to get out of bed, it hurt to walk. When 2020 hit in quarant with quarantine, I finally was, I felt like I was able to rest and rehab my knee to the point where I'm good. But I've spent so much time working on whether it was story fire or content or you name it, where I never really fully prioritized my health. There's a difference between looking healthy and actually being healthy. And I like looked healthy, but I wasn't. And I feel like I still am not. I might look okay, but internally, it, I don't think it's it's definitely not good. So my knee has gotten to the point where it's unbearable. I remember in 2019, I went to a lot of doctors and stuff. I got every scan imaginable to try to figure out what it was and unfortunately they couldn't find anything they didn't know i think it's because they weren't looking in the right spot but i'm probably gonna have to go back down that road again this should be hopefully like a chill next few days so i can rest oh my god are the dogs coming in oh sweet mason you guys get to be on the trip with us 
Dog B and B, bone and breakfast. Oh my! Is this all your food? You didn't want to film it when I had the like five other rolls out. No. I, literally, I think it was like a hundred dollars sushi order, and I'm like slowing down right now. Look at all this. Mm. Here's my little chicken rice. I got a whole thing of crab rice over there. I had we some egg from rolls. Three different places. Yep. We were so hungry. But I got fortune cookies in my dinner. So I wanted to open them. All right, I'll open mine first, I guess, yeah. since he's not ready. A vivid and creative mind is just one of your many great attributes. That was mine. I feel like this is yours. <laughs> I feel like we got the wrong one. Mine says like... I don't have a vivid and creative mind. What are they talking about? Mine says like, you try to surprise your boyfriend, but you got to immediately. Exactly. Let's see what yours says. Ashley yeah. started talking about her like st stitches and band-aids like on her under boob for her surgery while I'm, pl while I'm putting this on my food. That's why it's taking me so long to eat. I could live down here. This is just, like real, <laughs> really good. All right, let's not get ahead of ourselves. <laughs> we're only here for a couple days. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> no, is it the same one? <laughs> Dude, this is good. What's it say? Soothing your body is the name of the game today. No, nope, that's perfect. Th what the hell? That's perfect with your knee. Yeah, that's weird, right? I've never got one about like soothing your body. Like your health. Yeah, usually it's like riches and hard yeah, work and I? perseverance, not like soothe your body, dude. Your fucking knees are broken. Like, wait, so that means I do have a creative and vivid mind. So you have one, or you're going to be more. So it just says a vivid and creative mind is just one of your many great attributes. So actually, I do already have it. Yeah, it's telling you that you have to believe. Wow, I like that you guys literally just only looked at the ceiling for that part, but. <laughs> It was like uh, a few of those people's camera work in the competition. It's literally my camera work. <laughs> they should make them out of like vanilla so you can eat them and then it comes true. You know what I'm saying? Like that's how you finish it. That is a million dollar idea. You should come up with it, but you're create. I thought you're creative, dude. Obviously I'm not. Mine's wrong. Guys, take a look at this. I'm still waiting on my bacon, but mm, what'd you get by? Chicken wrap, chicken salad. Ooh, Doesn't great. taste as good when a fan hand delivers it, but. It's still good. What? My knee's still busted, by the way, guys. It it's, is. Uh, it's pretty miserable. And it's busted. raining, so. We're leaving today. We're leaving, like, a day early, but see this rain, guys. It is Do we want to talk about, like, the surprise last night? Or? I, think, I think we will when we get back. Or oh. back to the room. It's kind of uh, loud out here with the rain. Yeah. All right. So on a scale of 1 to 10, how bad was that trip? 1. It was the best. <laughs> Oh wait, one's bad? Yeah. Okay, one. one. Now, <laughs> my knee, guys, my knee. Yep. I talked to you about it. It's so bad. She didn't know two months ago. Did we mm. tell them that the surprise that you told me and then it would never happen? Nope, I didn't tell them. So, a few days ago, I found out that Hell's Kitchen in Atlantic City was having their grand opening. Like, and like I got the restaurant like, from the show, like yes. Blue Kitchen, Red Kitchen, Chef Ramsay. They only have like one other one, and I think it's in Vegas. But they just opened one, and I was like very lucky enough to get seating for that night at 10:30. And, and she told me that we were like walking yeah. back to the little Ocean City Airbnb, and she's mm -hmm. like, "Hell's Kitchen, us," and I was like, "What? That's sick!" I was like pumped, yeah. but meanwhile, I was literally limping back to our room and it was yeah. like i got back to the room i couldn't move i couldn't even walk no. and i told her that, that was after you were able to get on the boardwalk we were staying three blocks away from the boardwalk so we did walk up there mm -hmm. and you walked a little bit and then we pretty much like it was such a nice day i had to be holding on to ashley yeah. to be able to walk though mind <laughs> it was you. it was really such a bad. nice day so we just like sat um, under like this awning and pretty much just like people watched for like a good couple hours. It was nice, but that was like the extent of what mostly because I couldn't move. I just time. had to sit on a bench and watch people like an old yeah. man. I would see 90 year old men walking along the boardwalk perfectly fine or with a walker. Some and I over were, like can't biking, move. jogging. I'm just like, oh my god, yeah, <laughs> it's called just, I've neglected it for too long and yeah. I feel wiped right now. So I told her, I was like, dude, mm -hmm. I don't think we can go out, which kills me because I've watched like 10 seasons at least of Hell's Kitchen. Look up the Chef Ramsay. I was Ramsey. excited because last summer during the road trip was actually the first time that I got into watching Hell's Kitchen. Um, and we would watch it together. So I thought it was pretty cool that I was like able to get 
Take it, or say. not tickets, but reservations for opening night. Yeah, I made so sure, excited. though, Chef Gordon Ramsay was not going to be there on opening night. <laughs> I saw him reply to a comment. He was like, uh, look forward to seeing you soon. It didn't say to look forward to seeing you tonight. I think it opened mm -hmm. without him. So I, did, I don't think we missed out. We can always go there. And I think opening yeah. night would have been a madhouse. And it might not have been as good as like a more chill, intimate experience. That's know. what I'm telling myself. That's but what we're telling ourselves. I couldn't have even forced it's, it. It's it fine. sucks. It sucks. It's fine. It's a restaurant. We can always go back. It is what it is. But it sucks that I can't even do something like that because it's me. Which, so so instead wow. we just got some takeout and just ate at home. And I'm gonna go limp my we ass. We got some to dessert, the couch. ate at home, and then today it was like pouring down rain. It was like they nasty saw it. Out. Yeah, they saw us eating. Yes, it yeah. was nasty outside. So we're like, all right, let's just head home early because there's not much that he can do anyway. I can't do anything. We, we were actually supposed to check out till tomorrow morning, but I'm just like, let's let's just head back. There's nothing that we can do here. Or that and I can do. Yeah. She yeah, so I never time, like but... I I wanted to have like that moment of bringing the dogs on the beach and stuff, but it's just it was not gonna happen. Trust this me, week. it trust was me. not gonna hey, happen. Hey, trust me, when it happens, it'll be a lot <laughs> I know. lot better. Don't, I know. I'm glad we didn't spoil it, guys. Foreshadowing. Remember the day when you see the dogs on the beach, it'll be much more yeah. glorious. Hopefully, than this. hopefully. Your actual Ugh. birthday will be I mean, a I got nice a week. Day. I got a week to heal. You have so. a week. This so is birth 29, birthday guys. surprise getaway was a fail. We got away. so I <laughs> We succeeded. got away for like, it was like literally 48 hours we were gone. <laughs> but it also forced me to realize like I have to take care of this thing. Like Yes, you do. You, know, you need so. to get it checked out. Anywho. As he limps away. Well, it's stupid. The couch. I already, I he's, there's no way he's going to make it up these stairs. It's the same. Doctors out. are stupid guys i watched the mcdurian's medical mystery from five years ago you get every test imaginable they pretend they make things up diagnoses yep. for you and but it's like it's it's stress yeah dude like, no my it doctor literally, and maybe it's east bum doctors but my doctor literally told me he mm -hmm. said uh oh um you uh you're just getting older like bro i can't walk but at the, at the time he told you that you were only like what 28 27 27 yeah. you were 27 like no you should not be feeling like that at 27 no. at all so he's going to make his way to the couch and probably okay, plant there shit. until till tonight all. look out for a baking stream because the next baking stream i'm gonna let him decide <laughs> bless you bless you but yes, yeah, so I'm gonna let him decide on the dessert because it will be his birthday dessert. So keep an eye out for that. And yeah, I will see you guys soon. Bye guys.